triangles. The polygon with the fewest number of sides is the triangle. It has three sides and, as its name implies, three angles. It is considered a basic geometric shape because many other figures can be cut into triangles. From a physical point of view, the triangle is important because of its unique stability. If the lengths of the sides of a triangular framework are fixed, then even if the vertices are freely hinged, the shape of the framework cannot be altered without bending or breaking a side. This explains the frequent use of the triangle in structures of all kinds. Here we have a triangle with vertices marked A, B, and C. When we want to refer to a triangle, we usually list the letters of the vertices preceded by a small triangle. The order in which the letters are listed does not matter. In other words, our triangle could be referred to as triangle A, B, C, triangle B, C, A, triangle C, A, B, triangle A, C, B, triangle C, B, A, or triangle B, A, C. When the vertices are labeled with capital letters, many times the same letter in lowercase refers to the side opposite that angle. In other words, side line segment AB could be referred to as side C. Side line segment BC could be referred to as side A. And side line segment CA could be referred to as side B. Classifications of triangles. Triangles are classified in two ways, by the relative measures of their sides and by the measures of their angles. If a triangle has no congruent sides, it is called a scalene triangle. If it has at least two congruent sides, it is called an isosceles triangle. If all three sides are congruent, it is called an equilateral triangle. The following relationship should also be noted. In a scalene triangle, no angles are congruent. In an isosceles triangle, the angles opposite the equal sides of the triangle are congruent and all the angles in an equilateral triangle are equal. If all the angles of a triangle are acute angles, the triangle is called an acute triangle. If a triangle has a right angle, it is called a right triangle. If one angle of the triangle is obtuse, the triangle is called an obtuse triangle. Both classifications can be used together to describe a triangle. For instance, we could have an acute equilateral triangle, an isosceles right triangle, or an obtuse scalene triangle. Be aware that not all combinations are possible. For example, an obtuse equilateral triangle cannot exist. Specific markings can be placed on drawings to indicate information about the figure. For instance, in triangle ABC, this symbol was used to indicate a right angle. In triangle DEF, the congruent sides were identified using this mark and congruent angles were marked like this.